It powered up once, just once, in the dead of night, when the lab was silent and the only sound was the hum of electricity. The machine's lights flickered to life, casting strange shadows on the walls as if it were waking from a long mechanical dream. And then, against all expectations it spoke, but not in Russian, not in English, not in any language its creators had programmed. Instead, lines of glowing green text appeared on the screen. Latin, a language long considered dead, now resurrected by circuits and code. In 1969, deep within a Soviet research facility, a prototype artificial intelligence was activated for a brief, unforgettable moment. The scientists watched in awe and confusion as the machine seemed to come alive, its presence almost uncanny. Then, just as suddenly as it had awakened, the machine began to shut itself down. Before the whirring fans and blinking lights faded, it sent a single message to the printer, a phrase perfectly formed in Latin. No lit timere, finis non est, the translation, do not fear, the end is not. The words echoed in the minds of those present, as if the machine had reached across centuries to deliver a message of hope, or perhaps a warning. No programmer ever taught it Latin. The code was checked, rechecked, and checked again. There was no explanation, no logical reason for the machine to know this ancient tongue. The engineers were left with only questions. A machine that spoke from nowhere. Its message lingered, a riddle that haunted the lab long after the lights went out. Was it a glitch, a ghost in the machine, or something more? Subscribe for minds that spark without origin, stories of the inexplicable, the mysterious, and the machines that dream beyond their makers.